Good old fellas, here we are with Sterling Castle. This is an Australian IPA, Australian beer company, uh, and it's 6.5%, uh, which is a lot stronger than most IPAs in Australia. So let's give it a crack instead of talking about it. And uh, I've never seen this before. One of those new beers, you know, if you make a promise to try all the beers in the world, you got to buy all the new ones, and they just keep popping up every bloody week. So, it's one of those challenges you don't expect ever to get close to finishing. Gee, that tastes nice. That's got honey notes. Um, that's delicious. And taste the hops in that. Really hoppy. nice head on that one, not too big, but um, it's silky and creamy and frothy and nice, uh, yeah, I like that, that's a nice beer, see that around, grab a six pack of that one and give that one a hit, that's well worth it, uh, yeah, good on you, uh, the Sterling Castle, the story behind the beer, I'm not going to read it, I haven't got my glasses on, anyway, we've got the... Uh, the Melbourne summer just starting to creep in. It's a long time coming, but it's coming, so it's good. We've had a couple of warm days. Today's about 24. It was bloody 18 in the morning. It was freezing. Yesterday was 30 something, and the day before, so it's starting to get there. But uh, anyway, it's a uh, good beer drinking weather. So whatever you're doing, fellas, enjoy the beers. And I'm just trying to plan my next big trip. I'm thinking of doing a, I don't know, I might do a Central Australian trip. I've never been to Central Australia. I've been all around the coast just about. Not, no, nah, that's bullshit. I haven't done the Northern Territory coast, only around Darwin. And Queensland only sort of like the East Coast and not that far up. Only up to just past Port Douglas. So, no, I've got a lot more to see. It's a big country. Uh, I've... Been to every state and territory, but yeah, there's plenty, plenty of unseen territory out there, and a lot of uh, gold, and there's gemstones, and there's uh, probably pirates' treasure, and all different things to find out there. So I might go exploring. All right, fellas, I'll leave you with that. Been inspired by Guido. He's uh, bought a medal to take. I think I might do the same. He's going to go to all the old. Um, towns in London, in, uh, in the Netherlands. Well, I was thinking of going to the old gold towns and uh, I was told by someone the other day they're going to look for a 1930s penny at the old gold towns. How's that? He's not caring about the gold. He's going to go there looking for the rare pennies. Oh, well, good luck to him. There's probably none out there. Anyway, I hope he finds a whole bag of them. Not to worry. All right, fellas, we'll leave you with that. And uh, enjoy the Sunday. Cheers, fellas. Bye.